John G. Payton, Missionary to the New Hebrides, is a compelling autobiographical account by John G. Payton, a Scottish missionary who dedicated his life to spreading the Christian message among the cannibalistic tribes of the South Pacific's New Hebrides Islands. Payton's memoir serves as both a testament to his unwavering faith and a poignant portrayal of the challenges faced by early Christian missionaries. The narrative begins with Payton's childhood in Dumfrieshire, Scotland, where he was raised in a deeply religious household. This early exposure to Christian values instilled in him a sense of purpose and a desire to serve as a missionary. Payton's subsequent journey to the New Hebrides is fraught with dangers and difficulties, as he faces hostile environments, linguistic barriers, and life-threatening encounters with the natives. One of the most striking aspects of Payton's account is his vivid description of the islanders' customs and practices. The New Hebrides tribes are depicted as savage and deeply steeped in superstition, with cannibalism being a central feature of their culture. Payton's encounters with these tribes, often resulting in physical threats and attempts on his life, highlight the immense bravery and determination required of a missionary in such hostile circumstances. Payton's unwavering faith serves as a guiding force throughout his journey. In the face of constant danger and opposition, he remains resolute in his belief in God's providence and protection. Payton's reliance on prayer and his conviction that God will sustain him in the face of adversity demonstrate his unyielding commitment to his mission. This unwavering faith not only sustains Peyton but also serves as a source of inspiration for readers, emphasizing the power of belief in the face of overwhelming odds. Peyton's narrative also offers insights into the transformative power of education and the written word. Throughout his time in the New Hebrides, Peyton dedicates significant efforts to learning the local language and translating the Bible. He recognizes the importance of language as a bridge between cultures and uses it as a tool to convey his message to the islanders. Peyton's commitment to education extends beyond language acquisition, as he establishes schools and introduces Western knowledge and values to the native population. This emphasis on education reflects Peyton's belief in the power of knowledge and its potential to uplift individuals and communities. In addition to its thematic depth, John G. Peyton, missionary to the New Hebrides, is also notable for its engaging and emotive writing style. Peyton's vivid descriptions, coupled with his ability to convey his innermost thoughts and feelings, evoke a strong emotional response from the reader. The narrative is filled with moments of intense suspense, heart-wrenching loss, and profound joy, enabling readers to develop a personal connection with Peyton's experiences. Overall, John G. Peyton, Missionary to the New Hebrides, is a powerful account of a missionary's unwavering faith and dedication to spreading the Christian message. Peyton's memoir serves as a testament to the transformative power of faith, the importance of education, and the resilience of the human spirit. Through his compelling narrative, Peyton challenges readers to reflect on their own beliefs, the power of conviction, and the potential for positive change in even the most challenging circumstances.